Good day. Welcome to Martinez Design. In this tutorial, we are going to explain how to create foundation details using draft view. So from this section, you create a draft view out of it and you detail your work without affecting anything you have done here. So let's start. Please kindly subscribe, like and share on our YouTube channel. So go to view. So here you click on draft view and say create structural or reflecting or whatsoever you want to feel like you're okay, creating. But the best way to do is that you come here and say use call out. So here I want to create my my details from this aspect. So I draft it out. So okay. So for me, it has already given me the color section. So this is the aspects it brought out for me. You can adjust this. So like this, you click on it and add add it. Add the elements. So whatsoever you need to hide again, you hide as much as you feel like, so that your details will not be affected. So I do this from the view. Good. Hide again. Hide the elements. Fine. So now what you need to do is start giving your details one by one on what you are designing. So you can use your drafts to create all those things one after the other. So let us start by using by creating a pad for this space. So you click on annotate, click on detail line. So you set up your rectangular. Okay. Well, better stay. The leads use your your region by using masking region so that that place will be covered up and you'll be able to detail it to your test without affecting the sides. So good. So that aspect is being covered up and you adjust it to your I did the boundary. Yeah. So depend upon the depth you want to use. So I just want to use thickness of almost the thickness of 300. So from here, I would like to know the distance. So say at two to five, enter two to five, enter. So you can do this for now. Finish it. Good. So you are creating your detail aspect. So the next thing to do is to create your the line and this place now you create another detail line so this time around you can decide to use a normal line by drawing this okay mirror this So the aspect is so you extend it up. Like here now, you can decide to open the boundary as you go to the floor plan. Say okay. 
on your floor plan you can adjust it to okay so finish then I go back to section and you see so you have moved that aspect so drag it up so that is the detail of what you are creating so down this place now to make sure that the details of this part is out so you go to detail view fill the region fill region so you go to you can use the hagona and fill these aspects then now you mirror Align that. It's okay. Can see it finish. So you see the aspect of the details are coming out one after the other. So you can make you bring this to cover up some space that you don't want to be seen. Okay, like this as well. You can hide as many as possible. So all this I don't want to be seen there. It will only affect from the cutouts. So it doesn't affect your building per se. Like the elements. That's just going to be not be feasible in what you are designing. So as you have done that, so you bring your details into consistency. You draw more line, more detail line. Split this. So you draw more. With this line, change them to thin line. Like that. So here now, you can bring down to the region. Say so edit, duplicate it. So go to the Arduino and change patterns as much as you want. So let me do some blasting aspect or sandings. Okay. So here I want to use sandings create a details aspect of this okay good since our details are coming out one after the other you can use let me use this aspect as well you know, click finished so click similar press similar so this piece you put it on the other side at this side as well click finished so here what you do click and go to graphics of a right so edit by elements the projects projection you look at the pattern Projection, you look at the pattern and you decide to use the background, the surface transmission, trans, so visibility, you click, visibility, you click, say apply, 
is being off so you click on visibility again apply so foreground visibility apply so you change the pattern from here and give you concrete say okay apply it good now projection pattern so you just you can use dots good so that will disappear the aspect of what you are seeing at this open place so this one will help you and give you the confidence on what you are doing by arranging your space so after you finish the drawing like this so you begin to start your labeling one after the other in a traditional manner so click on text on the text the first thing to do write it there dpc okay the next one you can put it here external wall Put it again here. You can write depths. Just write depths. Depth sufficiency. Depth sufficiency of something like that. So you can rotate this. So with all this now, select this, select them all and click and say edit type, duplicate it so that you reduce the size of the letter and put it to like one. Okay, just reduce it. So it takes you up. So this will allow you to coordinate everything you've done. Remember, you are not doing it. This is detailing. You may dimension, you may not dimension. Depends on what you are doing. So, the most important is to know what you are doing and arrange it firmly. So, your as aspect is what you need to do and focus. Please kindly subscribe to our channel it's for daily basic drawing. We follow, we follow us as well in everything. At the same time, the comments, so whatsoever you see that you are not doing right, so please try as much as possible to tell us so that we'll improve on the next video. So that's how you do by bringing your details. Yeah. Good. So here now, we string this X from here. Click on this and say copy. this edge and I bring it here and so in this place now you toggle this aspect and it will, dis it will disappear so you can arrange this and at the same time you can say it should hide all the categories so this is this detail aspect of the drawing that you are uh, requested to do. 
So this will not affect any of your building. The sections are there, but this is for sectional detail. You can rename it and say the name. Where is the rename field? You call it any name you want to give it section. So you call it section DT. So you can name it whatsoever. So it will definitely appear in your drawing. Finish. So thanks. This is how to draw foundation details in this place so thanks for, for watching subscribe to our channel and